What is up guys and welcome to a new video. Now in this video I actually want to talk about time traveling and how bullshit it is. Like honestly, the amount of movies I've seen where they've got it all so wrong and I know this is probably from a nerd's point of view, but seriously some of this stuff needs to be corrected. And me being 800 subscribers, I'm probably not going to voice my opinion out too much. But at least some of you guys will understand what my point of view is supposed to be. So basically, think of, first of all, the zombies storyline. Because obviously, everyone subscribed to me is subscribed to me for gaming. There isn't really any reason why you'd subscribe to me for not gaming, since that's mainly what I do on this channel. Tutorials and a bunch of other stuff like that, if you're new, subscribe. Uh, but yeah. And the zombie storyline. So let's think about it. With the new edition of The Giant... How the characters go back in time and kill the old Richtofen or something like that. Well, basically, they have lived the entire time of going through the giant storyline. In the first time, Doris, yeah? And they've, they've done it all. They've done all the teleporting and all that bullshit. And eventually, you know, they've gone on, done the Easter eggs and all that kind of stuff. To the point where they're at the giant and they are now going back in time. But just think about that for a second. If someone goes back in time that means they're in the same position as if they would be when they went back in time so as weird as that sounds that basically means the old characters would have met themselves at the first time they ever met themselves so let's do it as person a being person a in the past and person b being the future person so pe people a they live their entire life and turn into people b we'll call it like that However, if people B go back, then that does mean that people A would have already met people B instead of people B meeting people A before people A have meet, has met people B. This is making so much sense, but basically what I'm trying to say is you cannot go back in time because you would have lived it first. So they would have already lived through their future selves coming back towards them without them not knowing about it and then going back to correct the fast. It just doesn't make sense. I hope I've explained it correct. I, I don't know, I probably haven't and I feel like I want to delve into more detail with it, but it just, I feel like I could put my point across there. But basically what I'm saying is, for the final time, for the final, final time, they would have met themselves the first time instead of their future selves coming back and trying to amend stuff. I hope that made sense. I hope that made sense. That was a summary of what I was trying to say. But frankly, that's why I feel as if all these time-traveling movies with the exact same plot with time-traveling, it just doesn't make sense. And I go into detail with everything, trying to think all the negatives and all the positives and all the things that work and don't work in movies and stuff. And probably it should be some sort of reacting channel at this point, shouldn't I? Flipping hell, imagine those. The mistitling is going to be unbelievable. But no, no, no. I think I've literally turned into me not doing live commentaries anymore. I, I, I just don't feel as if live commentaries are appropriate for my channel anymore. It's just a lot more, dif more difficult to actually do a live commentary. But maybe if I went back in time. Oh, wait. If someone came back in time to us right now, yeah? They would have already amended everything that would have been alright. So if you ever say, oh, what if someone comes back in time and says, um... Oh, watch out, there's going to be a massive meteorite coming to the world. And say they come in the next five minutes. They would come in the next five minutes. Not wait for me to wait another 14 years to then come back and tell the person. Because that would be the first time I've ever seen that message. I would see it now in the next five minutes. Not someone come back. Not, not myself come back and tell my past self. So it would happen like that in a vicious cycle that just keeps going on and on. But what am I talking about in this video? I'm talking about the flipping time traveling. And this is the longest commentary I've ever done without flipping doing a live commentary. Mate, I feel accomplished. But yeah, if you enjoyed this video for some reason, then leave a like about me just rambling on and not making any much sense about time traveling. Hopefully you understood. And if you did, I'd like you to comment down below that you understood what my point was going on. But like I said, if you're new, subscribe. Leave a like on this video if you enjoyed. Goodbye.